I am filling out my deposit slip. something organic but I can't get that because today because I don't have time I have to get back to work and um, crap I just messed up my deposit slip what is wrong with me today something's really wrong it's like everything I do I do it I mess up on it today it's just real weird you ever have days like that where just, you just think, oh my gosh, I think I'm officially retarded? <laughs> or as Allison's fat always says, Allison, she always says she's a tard. That's what I am today. I'm a tard, Allison. So you're not the only one that's a tard. You know what? This is so funny because I'm going to take out. I'm going to take out ten dollars cash back, just so that I can get something to eat, and it's going to be fast food. <gasps> Gas. It's going to be fast food because it's got to be fast, and it's got to be food. So there you go. Fast food. And. Um, which reminds me of something funny that I just want to tell you about. It's a funny little snippet of my life. My, um, my ex-husband <laughs> used to say, we would go to the drive-thru at McDonald's or Dairy Queen or whatever, Taco Bell. <laughs> They'd say, can you pull up? They usually do this a lot. They used to a lot at Jack in the Box. They still do. Can you pull up? And he goes, he would say, no, thank you. And they'd say, what? Can you pull up? Because the food's, you know, going to be ready. And he goes, no, I came here for fast food, so I'll, I'll just wait. And, and that needs to be fast. And it was so funny, but at the same time, I used to tell him, you know how many boogers are probably in our freaking hamburgers? Because you said that. <laughs> so gross. Anyway. I need some fingernails. I need some new eyebrows. I need new teeth. I need to color my hair. Maybe I should get a slot, uh, not slot piece, but oh, that sounds good. Maybe I should get a, um, subway chicken. Oh no, I can't because Subway, the one closest to me doesn't have a drive through and I can't go in because I'm wearing my pajama pants and these really ugly, ugly dog walking shoes. I look like an orphan, overgrown orphan child <laughs> with what I'm wearing. And the lady, what's funny right now is the people in the drive through have like the speaker and I know they hear me talking and they probably think I'm talking to my imaginary friend. I got a text message from my friend in New York. Or New Jersey. Oh, that's nice of her. Um, so they're all in there in the little blast-in building, you know? Like, probably looking at me thinking, I need some meds. <laughs> Which I probably do. Oh gosh. Tomorrow's my day off and I'm counting the seconds.
You know, I just had this kid in my mouth going like this, and there is no telling who has been handling this can and where their hands and fingers have been before it touched the skin. Oh, this lady next to me, she is staring. Oh, she's staring. <laughs> staring big time. I have a runny nose and a headache and I'm hungry. I want a cigarette. I haven't had one in 14 months. 14 months since I've had a cigarette. Pretty good, isn't it? I'm proud of myself. You know, the Lord did that. He really did that. He took that away from me, and I'm so thankful to Him, and I give Him all the thanks and the glory for that. Hey, it's, it's come down to drastic measures. I have to pretend like I'm talking on my cell phone. These people are really stupid. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because um, once people start looking at me like I really, really have grown a third eye, it's time to pull the cell phone out. That way I can talk to you. Wink, wink. And um, nobody knows the difference. I just think I'm talking on my cell phone. So that's what I'm going to do. So actually, I'm really not on the phone. I'm talking to you. YouTube land. Do you hear the rain in the background? Doesn't it sound good? It sounds so good. You know the deal with uh, my boss? Thank you. You know, just mentioning the word boss makes my eye twitch over here. And um, these people are probably going to wonder why I'm not down camping out at the homeless shelter, you know? Because that's, and I'm not being ugly, really, I'm not. I'm really not being ugly, but that's where a lot of the homeless, that's really where a lot of the crazy people go. And when I say crazy, I mean schizophrenic types. And I'm not making fun, because I used to work in the mental health, in a mental health facility, which made me the way I am today. <laughs> I am just going from one thing to the next today. I can't keep my mind on one subject. And you know what? The longer I sit here in this car, the more my head hurts. And um, it's really hurting today. So I know that y'all think I'm a vacuum head, which I'm really not. I just, between my fibromyalgia and my headaches, I think I'm going to have to go on to one of those places online and start ordering uh, Vicodin by the butt loads. Because this stuff the doctor gave me last time just is not cutting it. It's not, it's really not strong enough. I don't know what he gave me. I don't know what's in it. I guess I should take three of them to get them to work. Get out of the way, freak. Okay, well, I'm home now. I have a runny nose. I don't know what's up with that, but I ate my, I just came home and had my Weight Watchers dinner instead of going to the fast food place. So this is what I had. Smart ones, teriyaki chicken and vegetables. Yummy. It's real good. And um, I guess if I had had more time, maybe I would have gone and cheated and gone and got fast food, but I really didn't have the time, so I just raced home through the microwave and that's what I'm having, or that's what I have. Now I've got to go back to work.